Ta-da. All right, my friends out there in YouTube land, Rock and Dave, the real deal. You know what, Fort Myers, Southwest Florida. We're finishing off our stay up here in St. Petersburg at the uh, Adlin or Alden Hotel, I should say. It's called the Alden Hotel. And we were doing a, a wedding gig with a friend of ours. And there's some video footage of us playing. We'll have some more going up on YouTube. And I think Deb did put some on Facebook with us playing poolside. And the reason why I wanted to do this quick video is uh, to kind of address the situation where people think that you always have to play cover songs and it's ungrounded, so do what you want. Here comes house playing. <laughs> Never fails. Oh, you're going down the whole, yeah, elevator. Anyways, what I was gonna say, do what you want, you know, just make it as long as it sounds good. Because when we were just jamming down by poolside, um, couple young kids and I do mean young kids uh, more like a teenage girl and her younger brother coming out of the pool and your kid playing like kids usually play the first thing when they came out of the pool the girl started dancing to the rhythm getting into it and Julio my friend was playing the girl guys we looked at each other and we said you know what his other sister was there Julio's sister was there you know and we're talking the rhythm if you have a strong sense of rhythm people will always get into it no matter what no matter what it is, you know? And doesn't, no matter what style of music, you know, people have different styles of music that they like. But the notion that you have to play this and you have to play that, you can do what you want. But if it comes out sounding bad, it just flat out gonna sound bad, you know? We all have our good days and bad days. But if you don't have a good, strong sense of rhythm, that's why I love to improvise a lot because at that moment in time, that's when I feel it the most, Go ahead and share it. Um, but it, it could always be the rhythm. And I used to ask some of my students, young kids too, very first time you hear a song, what is it that grabs your attention? Nine times out of 10, they say the way the beat it makes them feel. The beat, I said, it's the rhythm, yeah. I said, that's okay, they didn't know what that's called, rhythm, but you know, it's, it's the rhythm that gets them. So, you know, always keep that in mind. Play as many covers as you want to. You know, go ahead and do what you want. But whatever it is you do, make sure that you also like it and then have a strong sense of rhythm. That's all. And trust me, <laughs> people will get into it. Okay, my friends, yours truly, Rocket Dave, North Fort Myers, Southwest Florida. Until next time, God bless.